So guys, I had my third fall. First the ribs, last week on the mountain bike, my first mountain bike ride back, I fell softly. Now I took a lovely tumble over the pole, survived it, hurt my hand, but luckily I have good gloves on, so I hope it's over, three falls. I thought about the three fall thing when I broke my ribs and I came back on the bike and I was like, yeah, this doesn't happen. It's not gonna happen to me, but hey, three falls, now it should be over, I hope so. This was really an idiot uh, move, but uh, hey, those exist as well. The ribs was idiot. The mountain bike last week was just a confidence thing. But now the confidence is really shot. It's crazy, man. Crazy. I could have just gone around there. But this pole hasn't been here forever. And I was looking at my uh, front disc brake. Got to check if the bike's okay. favorite trails and I haven't ridden it at all this year I haven't really been to work on the mountain bike except last week because of the ribs serious bummer but now I'm riding on the gravel bike anyway it's checking behind me to see if anyone's coming up it's easy to follow mountain bikes on a flat trail, I find, but not an undulating trail like this. And my tires are way too hard, but I will do some road riding soon, so I don't want to let them down. They're full bar. Oh no, 40 p's high, sorry. 40 p's high. Oh, this trail is looking good, man. I need to get the mountain bike. Oh shit. Oh, I need to get the mountain bike out here. Looking good. I thought it would be a bit more sandy. We've had some rain, so. That's great. It's looking fast. It's always nice if you're on the gravel bike just to ride the trails and see how they are. Instead of coming all the way out here with a mountain bike and then you can't ride them. So it's too sandy. In the summer, this area turns out to be quite sandy. Looking good. 